Hello there, this is Carlo. Welcome yet to another exciting, or I think exciting, After Effects tutorial. Where this is based around the Annabella uh, sketch that I did uh, a little while ago uh, regarding screen replacement. So here it is. We're going to replace the screen or the picture on the screen with something of our own, which is very easy to do. Very easy. Okay. So, first thing first, we're going to track this footage. Come up to animation. And let's track camera. Now, depending on the spec of your computer, the quality and length of your clip uh, determines how long this will take to track. So we're just going to wait that for that to initialize and track. And once this is tracked and finished, we're going to come right back. Okay, so that is tracked. Now, in theory, what you're really meant to do okay is use something as a tv track sheet uh which is looks like this um i have one of these which works with all size tv so you just basically stick it a bit of blue tack a bit of something um to the tv and it will make your track a hell of a lot better a hell of a lot smoother but the tracking uh feature in after effects works so well you may not need to use it so what we're going to do is i'm going to click select three points on this uh, to make a flat plane. I'm going to hold shift and then I'm going to select one, uh, two uh, and three. And as soon as I select this, we should have our flat surface. I'm going to right click on that and create solid and camera. So we've got our solid here and camera right there. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to import something I want to add to the screen. It could be anything you want. Um, Let's have a look what we can add, guys. Uh, let's add this bit of video footage, which is my end uh, title thingy, Bobby, whatever you want to call it. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to hold with this solid selected. You're going to hold down Shift, click on your mouse button, and drag this to the solid and release. Right, so, okay. So that should hopefully uh, track to the footage right so but what we need to do first is we've made this a 3d layer um we're going to fix this uh layer here hit s on the keyboard let's scale it down to start off with and let's make it fit our tv screen okay guys uh, get our rotation tool come down to the bottom and just bring it up slightly uh, let's bring the y-axis down a touch let's scale it up just a bit um, and let's scale this down just a bit and it's about finessing and just playing around with the overall uh, scaling and matching it up to the screen thing let's just put that there quick and dirty now you can feather this out do whatever you want if you do a little mask Let's get a rotation tool and just rotate it. Make sure you're at keyframe one, guys. Sorry about that. Should have told you that. And yeah, that don't look too bad. We've got a bit of screen popping out there, but it doesn't matter. This is just going to give you a rough idea of how we do it. Now, hopefully, when we play back, we have our replacement screen on our TV, which is pretty goddamn cool. All we have to do is fix and cover up the bits that we don't want to see behind the screen you know feather it out fix it up make it all look absolutely stunning like so and there you have it guys quick and simple screen replacement uh, in After Effects